this brief session I'm going to demonstrate how to insert hyperlinks in a slide. Hyperlinks are a great tool in PowerPoint and uh, sometimes you might be in a meeting where you are presenting something but yet you want to link to another document or another site or something outside of the slideshow that you are presenting. And there are a couple ways of hyperlinking. You can hyperlink specific text. So whenever you click on that text, it will take you to a specific location. Or you can hyperlink images. For example, as soon as you click on this image, it will take you to some other location on the web or wherever. So let's uh, learn first how to hyperlink text. Basically, the way it works is that first you have to know what you want to hyperlink. Uh, and you have to go and get the link for that item. Let's say that I have here my, I want to hyperlink to this uh, video on YouTube. And by the way, this is the Excel 2013 tutorial that I already have posted here for uh, you to view. So I go ahead and copy the URL here. You can right click and choose copy or control C or however you copy a link out there. And then let's minimize it. Then we select the text. You can select the text that you want to hyperlink, whether it's a whole, more than one word or just a single word. And then you click here under the insert tab, and then you choose hyperlink. Once you choose hyperlink, of course, you could link to a specific document in your computer, or in this case, I'm linking to an address on the web. So I just paste it here, right click, choose paste or control V or however you paste stuff and then click OK. So that's one way. Notice now it's in blue. This text is in blue. The second method is to hyperlink actual images. So let's say I have this image here and I want to hyperlink so I can click on it and go to a specific site. So of course, again, you'd have to copy the URL that we did earlier. Now we go here under the image, we click on hyperlink, and then we basically, the same way, we paste the URL over here. Then click OK, and we are set. Now the difference is, is that um, you don't really know that this is hyperlinked unless you click on it and choose edit hyperlink or view the hyperlink and things of that nature. Now for the audience, they'll know that this is linked because the text is going to be in blue. Now if I go and present this, which by the way, if I want to present from this current slide, I could either do Shift F5 or I could go under Slideshow and choose from the current slide. That is basically the same thing, Shift F5, like it says here. And now notice the text here is in hyperlinked. Notice it says YouTube and so on. And then this as well, it's hyperlinked. I could click on either one of those and it'll go and take me to that link on YouTube. So that's how it basically works. Hyperlinking, it's a great tool. It's a great feature and highly encouraged to be utilized.